It's been one of the most talked about storylines in Canada today. It's been trending on and off on Twitter all day. Raptors Celtics game seven on the hard court tonight with the winner advancing to the Eastern Conference Finals. Now for Raptors fans, they already know this isn't the team's first rodeo in a game seven. Carter at the buzzer. No go. And the Sixers hold on. I know Raptors fans, I'm sorry to do this to you because for some of you, it's still too soon to go back to the 2001 conference semifinals. Yes, the game where the Raps featured Vince Carter for the last time against the one and only Allen Iverson. It was a devastating one point loss that ended the Raptors season. Going through your mind when Del Curry hit that shot, pulled it within one in the final minute of the game. No, I was just, you know, I knew that they had some more time. We had to get off a shot. Um, I missed a shot, but my teammates just kept fighting. Then, fast forward 12 years later to another nail biting game seven with the man who would call himself the truth, AKA Paul Pierce. Loses it, scoops it up, slotted away. The Raptors lose in the first round of Brooklyn by one point again, ending the Raptors' first playoff run in six seasons. But this is the same year that we got the We the North slogan, so there was a positive. But to keep track so far, Raptors have lost both Game 7s they've been in, but I promise things go only up from here, like 2016. I know it was stressful, but... The Raptors take Game 7. First round, the Raptors beat the Indiana Pacers in a Game 7 showdown, and by more than one point. More than one point. Nagara with a slam dunk. Same year, same team, same magic, but with authority. The Raptors dominated the Miami Heat in Game 7 of their 2016 conference semifinals, winning the game 116 to 89. Yes, they would go on to lose, I know, to big bad LeBron James and the Cavaliers in the Eastern Conference Finals. But a quick recap now, the Raptors are 2-2 two and two in Game 7s, but nothing was more glorious than the last Game 7 they played in. Why not play this video over and over again? That shot broke the Raptors' ticket to the Eastern Conference Finals where, I don't know if you know this, but the Raptors would go on to win their first NBA title that year. I'm being sarcastic, people, if you didn't catch on. It was amazing. We the North, we the champs. So tonight, it's going to be a stressful game. The Raptors have a 3-2 and two record now when it comes to Game 7, and odds makers have the Raps as the underdogs, but they thrive on that. Feeling a little nervous, but confident that we'll come out with the victory tonight. Game 7, are you, how are you feeling? Are you stressed? I'm not stressed. I have all the confidence in the world we're going to win tonight. Definitely a little stressed, but um, I'm looking forward to it, and I think, yeah, I think we're going to win. Tip-off tonight for Game 7 between the Raptors and the Celtics is just after 9 p.m. For CD News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.